Apple's annual developers conference kicks off today in Cupertino, California. And this year, the company's unveiling one of its most anticipated products in nearly a decade. It's called a mixed reality headset, meaning it's capable of both virtual reality and augmented reality. Luckily, NBC News technology correspondent Jake Ward is out there for us following every moment of the conference. Uh, Jake, let's start with this new headset that everybody seems to be excited about. What do we know? Uh, what could it do? What's its impact on VR? Well, just a few minutes ago, Kate, we learned it is called the Apple Vision Pro, and it is, as you say, a mixed reality headset. You can both see your surroundings and superimpose things on top of them. The company says that you'll have these lifelike experiences, both with apps that appear sort of floating in front of you. You can walk around them. They cast shadows on your surroundings, but also life-sized uh, relationships with people you're speaking to via FaceTime um, and the ability to capture multi-dimensional video of scenes around the house and then play them back such that you'll feel like you're peering into the depths of them. What does all this cost? It's going to be about $3,500 and comes out early next year, Kate. And of course, that smacks us right into the question of what exactly is this for? Why exactly would people spend that amount of money on this? Not exactly clear yet. Uh, it is uh, mostly today all about showing it to developers who, of course, have gone on to build whole industries on top of other Apple products like the iPhone, the Apple Watch, and the iPad. Yeah, I kind of remember when we, we thought that, what was it called? The iPod. We were like, why are we going to need that? Remember? <laughs> way, way, way back. That's right. That was the sort of, that was right. That's the early primitive form of that technology. Yeah. And then look at where we are. Yeah, Maybe exactly. that's what's going on here. I have to say, you know, I was expecting a, a little bit more of a sort of, you know, sleek Apple look. It has to, I have to say, it looks like a pair of ski goggles, but the experience, yeah. according to Apple, is going to be so lifelike, we're going to be sucked right in. Jake, what else today? Because I know there were a lot of, um, I heard about phone changes and all kinds of things. Yeah, on top of this news about the Apple Vision Pro, we also saw changes to the new operating system that we all carry around on our iPhones. It's going to include the ability to do these funny sort of retro things with a futuristic twist. One of them is being able to listen in on messages that you will be uh, able to uh, literally have live voicemail as uh, I call you and leave a message and say, Kate, I'm at your house. Let us, you know, in. Uh, you'll be able to read that off the screen. It's uh, those sorts of features along with a new lineup of uh, thin MacBook, uh, MacBook Airs uh, and uh, new ways to share video and audio across devices, um, you know, a wide range of things announced on top of the Apple Vision Pro here in Cupertino. All right, Jake Ward watching it all. Jake, thank you. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.